There's a great many icons in professional wrestling. And I could name off a bunch, but one of my absolute favorites of all time was Ricky the Dragon Steamboat. To me, he was just the best. I, I am not sure if I can quantify why I thought that. Uh, and I don't think I should have to because Ricky really just if you watch those matches with Flair if you watch those matches with um, Randy Savage if you watch the matches with Jake the Snake you see a whole lot going on with that guy so when I saw the opportunity to actually own the WrestleMania figure, I, I I grabbed onto it immediately. It's one of the best outfits he wore, in my opinion. It just looked great. I love the texture of the dragon on the back and everything like that. It just looked phenomenal, and the match was phenomenal. It's one of those early matches in WWF history that people go back and go, oh, that one. People still argue it's the best WrestleMania match of all time. Don't know about that, but I will say it is one that is really great and changed a lot of rules about how you put on a wrestling match. And you can tell both Savage and Steamboat knew what they were doing and really worked out that match to a T. And it shows in every movement. And... You know, credit to Randy Savage, too. I mean, he that match would not be near as good without the other guy. I mean, he had to have two, and both of them had to be a part of it, and both of them had to work it, and they did, and it's fantastic. So, getting to the figure, I mean, it's an older figure. I mean, when I have bought... I've bought a one Ricky Steamboat before this, and... It was a later version when he had the TV title, but this is kind of this is kind of what I expect when I see Ricky Steamboat, and that sticks out to me. That's what I kind of what I wanted in my collection, just because that really started me on. I mean, I was kind of a fan of wrestling forever. But I wasn't a diehard fan until after WrestleMania 3. WrestleMania 2, uh, it, it kind of helped, but WrestleMania 3 really cemented my love of wrestling. That was top to bottom. I want to know what, every, I wanted every match. And was not disappointed by very many of them. Especially not this one. This was the match I wanted to see. It came out perfect. And... Steamboat came out perfect, and I just always enjoyed it so much, so, so very much. I really loved it. And Ricky the Dragon Steamboat, to me, that made him one of the greatest of all time, and still one of the greatest of all time. So this figure, like I said, it's a little older, and... It's really hard to grade a figure that's a little older on today's standards. Ugh, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it because, you know, it's not fair. And I, I, I'm going to just say this is something I've really wanted for a very long time. I got a deal on it. Such a good deal. Such a good deal on this one. And uh, it's complete. It's got everything. I really like it. If they do another one, I would probably buy it. Yes, yes, absolutely. Uh, but that's okay. I'll keep this one too because they're, this one is so phenomenal and such a big imp big impact that I'll I'll keep it. So that I'm not even going to give it a rating. I'm just going to say it's a good figure. I really love it. If you get a chance to get a good deal on it, just get it because it's after, it's, it's Ricky Steamboat. We you can't go wrong. Okay, I'm going to wrap this kind of overview, review, I don't know, up and uh, going to say like and subscribe because, you know, this is a, this is fun.